Hello everyone, welcome to a new tutorial. Today I'm going to explain to you how you can import Mogart files inside Premiere Pro. This is a fairly simple thing to do, but while doing it you might encounter on several issues. One of the biggest issues with Mogart files can be Premiere Pro crashing. And this is something that happens when you import corrupted Mogart files. So in order to avoid Premiere Pro crashing and reporting an error, there is just one simple thing that you need to do while importing the Mogarts. So for importing the Mogarts, you first need to activate the Essential Graphics panel. In order to activate this panel, you need to go to Windows and choose Essential Graphics. Inside the Essential Graphics panel, do not import Mogart files directly over here on the main panel. Because in case you have corrupted Mogart files, Premiere Pro will report an error immediately and afterwards when you try to reopen Premiere Pro you might not be able to do it. I had a problem where I couldn't open Premiere Pro again after trying to import those corrupted files because this essential graphics panel stayed open and the corrupted file was over here in the main screen. So Premiere Pro just kept showing me the error and crashing over and over again. Therefore, when you try to import new Mogart files, the first thing to do is to create a new folder inside this main screen. So just click over here, add folder, name it whatever you want, and then just click on that folder and enter inside of it. Over here is where you need to import the Mogart files. So to install the motion graphics templates, you need to click over here on this icon. And of course, you need to find the place where you downloaded the Mogart files. In order to import Mogarts, you need to import them one by one. Another way of importing Mogarts is to go through the core Premiere Pro files, but I personally prefer this way, and that is just because I want to avoid additional crashing of Premiere Pro. So uh, I prefer to handle every single Mogarts file one by one. Even though it takes a little bit more time, but eventually, in this way, I'm avoiding a lot of errors that Premiere Pro can show. So after importing the Mogart files, you just need to drag and drop them over your footage. Now this is one of my own Mogart files, which you can download over here on the channel, so make sure to check them out. And this file, of course, is not corrupted. If this file was corrupted, I would now receive a Premiere Pro error and it would crash. But afterwards, when I try to reopen Premiere Pro, I will not have any issues because I separated this folder and I separated the corrupted Mogart file from the rest of the files. But afterwards, when I try to reopen Premiere Pro, I will not have any issues because I separated this folder and I separated the corrupted Mogart file from the rest of the files. This is the main thing that this is the main thing that's going to save you a lot of headache because I eventually had to reinstall Premiere Pro all over again when I encountered these issues with the installing of Mogarts. After you have identified the corrupted file, to get rid of it, you can either click on it directly inside the folder that you created, and then go right click and delete, like this. Or you can just go to the main screen and choose the whole folder that you have created, in case there are a couple of corrupted Mogart files, so just right click and delete the whole folder. So basically the point is to isolate the corrupted files, actually to isolate any file that you are importing because at the beginning you have no idea if the file is going to be corrupted or not. And that's it for this video guys, I hope you like it. If you found it helpful, please drop a like and leave a comment, I would really appreciate it. And make sure to check the freebies on my channel.